guys, I'm Sarah Ullman. And I'm Kylan Hack, and, and this, this is Atomic, Atomic TV. TV. Drama Club meets after school today in the auditorium for some fun games to kick off the weekend. Bomb Squad will be working on Christmas decorations for the hallways and posters for the big game tomorrow after school in the cafeteria as well today. Outdoor Club meets at lunch in Mr. Albertson's room for food and fun. The PCSA made a new t-shirt. Let's go check it out. Hey Bombers, I'm Brandy Andrews and I'm here with Caitlin and Julia. So there was a t-shirt competition with the PTSA, so what is the PTSA? PTSA is the Parent Teacher Student Association and we raise money to go towards um, scholarships and helping teachers out, clubs, stuff like that. So I heard you won the competition, so what inspired you to make that shirt? I saw an announcement about it, so I kind of just threw some ideas together and just came up with it. So when can these be sold? And we will be selling them in front of the office at different days, so you'll see the booth setting up. I know next week we'll be up there all week, mm -hmm. and, and then we'll have some of them at the football game. Go Bombers! <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Congrats on winning. Now back to the studio. The Bomber Boosters are selling state shirts for $10 in the concession stand at the gym and at the basketball game on Friday night. Get pumped, Bombers, because the first home boys basketball game of the year is tonight at 7.30 at home versus Ferris. The boys, JV, and freshman team will be playing at 5.45 as well. See you guys all there. Girls basketball will be in Post Falls this evening with varsity at 5.30 and JV and C team at 4 o'clock. Wish them luck. Wrestling will be at the Bob Mars Invite at Kennewick High all day tomorrow. Wish those boys luck. Don't forget to wish football players good luck, too, as they head off to state this morning. We also hope to see you Bombers representing the Dome tomorrow as well. Here's Morgan and Dylan with more, more information. Hello, Bombers. My name is Dylan Dreamus. And I'm Morgan Huff. And welcome to this week's Atomic, Atomic Sports, Sports Recap. Recap. The Richmond Bomber football team is going to state. Their previous game against Skyview was a doozy with a total score of 35-7. to The Richmond Bombers will be playing at the Tacoma Dome this Saturday. Recently our winter sports have begun and our boys basketball team won 86-81 to against Lewiston and our girls basketball team lost against Wenatchee 49-52. Wish our teams good luck this week and back to the studio. The new after school meal program will be starting on Monday. Remember to be positive and respectful to keep this program going. Now please give your utmost attention as you watch these short videos. Today we wear green to represent depression awareness. Teen depression is a serious mental health problem that may cause a persistent sadness or lack of interest in activities. It affects how you think, feel, and behave. It can also cause emotional and physical problems. It's not exactly what causes depression. But a variety of issues may be involved. These include brain chemicals, hormones, inherited traits, and trauma. Sometimes teen depression can result from environmental stress. But whatever the cause, and there will be a noticeable change in thinking and behavior. Teens may lose interest in activities they once enjoyed. Lose motivation. Even become withdrawn. Have drastic changes in sleep and eating habits. Have difficulty concentrating. Feel irritable. Constantly sad or hopeless. Or have physical complaints like stomach aches. Headaches. And fatigue. There are only a few warning signs. Most teens feel unhappy at times. This is pretty normal. Depression symptoms begin to continue or interfere with your life. You should tell someone. Depression symptoms likely won't get better on their own. There aren't any specific medical tests that can detect depression. He healthcare professionals determine if a teen has depression by conducting interviews and psychological tests. Uh, your mental health care provider will then determine the best course of treatment for you. <laughs> Remember, you aren't fighting this battle Research indicates that one out of every four teens will experience a major episode of depression during high school. Don't suffer, and please don't let another friend suffer as well. Talk to someone and get help. Don't settle for feeling just okay. You deserve to feel good. We had two lunchtime activities in the cafe today. Go grab some chalk and write letters of affirmation around the RHS campus. Miss Tri-City's outstanding teen, Abby Falk, will also be in the cafe, uh, raising awareness about teen depression. Please come listen to what Abby has to say. On Monday, please remember to wear white in support of bullying prevention. Thanks, Bombers. Back to the studio. Thank you, Bombers. Now please stand for the pledge.